In this tutorial you will learn how to delete database records using DMX Zone App Connect and DMX Zone Database Updater. We'd like to list our records in a dynamic table and allow users to delete any of them by clicking a button. We added an empty dummy table on our page. We will need to create two server actions. One for listing the records on the page and another one for deleting them. First, let's create the records listing server action. Add a database connection. Then, add a database query. And set up your query options. Select and add your table to the tables list and then add the columns you need. We add all of the table columns to the query selection. Click OK and then save your server action. Open the App Connect panel and add App Connect to your page. Then add a new component. Under Data, select Server Connect. Let's call the Server Connect component list and select your server action with the query listing the records. Now, let's add the repeat region in our table. Select the table body and add repeat children. Select an expression for the repeat region. Under the server connect component data, select your database query. Then bind the data you'd like to show in the table cells. Then, when you are done binding the data, let's set up the delete button. Click inside the repeat region where you'd like to insert it. In our case, this is the last cell in the table row. Open the insert menu and add a form. Then, click inside the form and add a hidden field. Select the hidden field which we added and add new dynamic attribute to it. Under input, select value and select an expression for it. Here, we bind the record ID field returned by our database query. And then, click inside the form and add a submit button. Now, as we are done setting up the dynamic table, Let's create the delete record server action. Open the server connect panel and create a new server action. We call it delete. Click globals. Then browse to your delete record page which we were working on and select your form from the drop down and click the import from form button. Then Add a database connection. Right click the database connection step and add database delete. Set up the delete options. Then select your database table and add it to the selected tables list. Select your record ID column and add it to the filters. This is the same column we are using as a value for the hidden field in the dynamic table. Then, select the filter value. Under Globals, Post, select the hidden field. And click OK when you are done. Save your server action and open the App Connect panel. Click your form in the App Connect tree and change its handler to Server Connect. Then, bind the delete server action to it. In order to reload the data on the page, when a record is deleted, add new dynamic event. And under server connect menu, select on success. And then select the action to be executed on success. Under the server action, which lists the records on our page, select load. And we are done. Let's preview the results. Soon as we click the delete button, 
the selected record is deleted, and the data is refreshed. That's how easy it is to delete database records using DMX Zone App Connect and DMX Zone Database Updater.